Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello and Assalamu alaikum all. I hope you all are doing good. First of all, I would like to thank Korean Society for Internet and Information and Iconi for the paper acceptance. Uh, the title of my paper is Comparative Analysis of Trending Agile Model Tools for Software Development Lifecycle. I am the presenter Mavis Shi. I am a research assistant of Mehran University of Engineering and Technology, Jamshoro. I am from Pakistan. The table of contents we will cover in this presentation are the introduction part, uh, the literature review in which we will see agile versus traditional methods and agile growth, uh, agile tools and its comparison based on some characteristics and finally the conclusion and the future directions. Uh, before understanding a topic, we must know what is software development lifecycle, what is agile and why it is needed to adopt agile in software development lifecycle. So basically the software development lifecycle is a phenomena of designing, developing and testing high quality softwares. The ultimate goal is to produce high quality software that satisfy customers requirements. And the change is inevitable. And this change is known as agility. The ability to respond to a change is known as agile. So the agile in software development life cycle collaborates in decision making and developmental process as it combines iterative and incremental approaches, provides flexibility, customer satisfaction and deliver functional softwares on time. So the agile strategies can help in reducing cost it helps in improve quality, productivity, and customer satisfaction. So this research aims to specify top 16 agile tools and their comparison and the trends over the last two decades. Uh, this is the agile SGLC process flow. Uh, the first step is to gather and evaluate the requirements. After the requirements are gathered and evaluated, it, they are then designed. They are designed using uh, UML, uh, UML models, flowcharts, and other designing tools, designing strategies. So after that design, that, that design is implemented and the model is built. Once the model is built, it is then deployed. Then after deployment, it is then tested. It verifies whether all the requirements are perfectly incorporated or not. And finally, once the product is tested from the development end, it is then moved to the, it is then sent to the uh, user to uh, for getting the feedback. In literature review part, we cover five papers. In the first paper, uh, it is about the survey of 2019. It is based on the agile and agile tools used in information technology. And according to that survey, uh, it elaborates the features of agile tools that it helps in uh, uh, increasing flexibility. It helps in reducing costs. It helps in continuous improvement. It helps in customer satisfaction, fast product delivery. And, uh, uh, and thus, it is a shift towards modern agility. In the second paper, it, it uh, we go through, it is also uh, on about the Agile tools and it is a study of 2021. The third paper is also based upon the uh, Agile tools and it survey what tools are used at that time and how much that tool is used, how much rating of that tool is uh, by the uh, end user. The fourth paper we go through is also upon the agile techniques used in software development. Also, it elaborates the features of agile that it is really helpful in remote context. And the fifth paper we go through, it, uh, it tells us that it is best for all type of organizations, whether are small, medium or large. Also, it tends to adopt and tends to work with other methodologies like Scrum, Kanban, etc. This table shows the agile versus traditional methods, which shows that agile methods are more flexible to desired modifications. They are easy to modify. They are adaptive. They are customer oriented. They are used for all size of project size.
utilize and uh, uh, and it uh, and it utilize very low resources when compared to the traditional methods they are hard to modify they are predictive they require very very large amount of resources this graph shows the number of publications on agile in recent years as compared to the last two decades okay now agile tools it is the focus of the paper in this we discovered 16 agile tools in which the first one is jira it is the mostly used tool it is a collaborative tool for the software designers and developers also jira query language is used to apply custom filters active collab it is a web-based platform agile for scrum it is a real-time dashboard spera team by inflectra it is a tracking project management it also used agile uh, up extreme programming scrum methodologies uh, pivotal tracker it helps for mobile and web developers in development and tracking of all events before actually deploying the uh, their apps microsoft visual studio teams it automatically manage code or code versions ice scrum it's an open source agile tool uh, sprint ground is an excellent tool for agile software engineers version one it supported distributed environment uh, working in, in agile tools from the remote areas uh, taiga is an open source tool and agilean this is also a tool for uh, project planning and process automation in small and medium sized business rike it also allows manage to uh, manage different projects and teams to achieve customization and cooperation and trello uh, it uh, items are described by board suite list uh, exosoft it involves development planning process step determination good communication with the developer and detection and resolution of problems prior to delivery phase plan box it's a scrum based cloud based agile solution asana it helps to communicate coordinate and track project process so all these tools support many features in one way or the other this is the comparison chart of agile tools we discuss above and uh, based on some characteristics listed here and it shows which tools support which characteristics and which not for example jira is a web based it's an online it and it support cloud based it's uh, it is divided into tasks it divides milestones it generate reports it uh, it have multiple user roles uh, it has different pricing schemes it but it is not a free version and uh, it is not a platform based and so on these are the tools based on some characteristics finally the conclusion part uh, so basically this research provides insight regarding top agile sdlc tools used by software experts when compared to traditional software development techniques the adoption of uh, agile methodology that enable developers and customers to construct a more transparent and adaptable model many improvements in the product development process as well as flexibility and cooperation are evidenced by agile process top 16 agile tools are discussed in this research that help developers in better planning and controlling their operations to obtain the greatest outcomes in the team communication and resource allocation while utilizing the agile techniques so the future directions for research will be it will be valuable to conduct similar objective investigation on a larger data set on a larger scale with more qualities and tools that might be incorporated for comparison these are the references we have used in this article. These are the authors of the paper. I am the presenter, Mavish Sheikh. And this is Aiza Khan, a postgraduate student. Uh, Dr. Isma Farah, an associate professor. Zakawana Qureshi, he is also a postgraduate student from the Department of Software Engineering, Merhar University of Engineering and Technology, Jamshuru, Sindh, Pakistan. Thank you so much, everyone. If you have any questions and concerns, please do ask. Thank you.